Hi, this is Mark Morrell from Toon Barn. We're here at New York Comic Con 2019. We're talking about the 20th anniversary of Batman Beyond with Lauren Tom, Ooh. who played Dana. Yes, I did. I was very lucky to have been such a part of a big epic show like this. Right. Now, your character was never in any comic books before this. I know. So what was it like for you not have to... You didn't have to worry about a comic book version of your character. That's a good point. And, and the beauty of it is that, um, you know, Alan Burnett just told me a story that when Bruce heard my voice, he went, oh, that's it. And I was like, oh, my gosh, thank God, because that's just my regular voice. <laughs> and and I, I basically just played her as, uh, you know, I, I am an Asian-American gal, and I grew up in the Midwest, and so I might have even had like a flat A, like candy and ant, maybe. Um, um, but I, I just kind of like was able to, that you know, it wasn't as hard when, when something's so close to yourself, and I just decided since I wasn't really, you know, that far away emotionally and mentally <laughs> from someone that was 16, I just kind of played myself. Yeah. Okay, so... All those times where Terry had to go away and he basically stands Dana up and yeah. she gets frustrated with that. Did you ever think there was still a future for the two of them together? Well, I, of course I was always hoping because it, it's amazing when you, you know, you feel amazingly fortunate when you come in contact with someone of such greatness. You know, I mean, and just in my real life too, I feel like that, you know, like to, to meet someone like that. And But then as you think about it, you know, <laughs> it's probably too much information, but it's like, would I as a woman, like, would that be enough to just be a great person's wife, right? Or would I want to also follow my own, like, discovery and path of what I have to offer to the world? Like, I would think that it would be Dana's dream come true to marry Terry, which she does, you know, um, but then also to find out who she was too would be like really, I think, the, the whole deal, the whole complete deal, because otherwise I'm not sure. I don't know how that would feel, you know. And are you glad Rat Boy's gone? <laughs> yes, yes. Oh, boy, I do really remember that episode. Yeah, with the remote control. Yeah, that was, that was Dana's episode, actually, even though it was so creepy. Yeah. <laughs> I want to thank you for joining us on Toon Barn here at New York Comic Con for the 20th anniversary of Batman Beyond. Thank you very much. Uh, you know her from Futurama. You know her from King of the Hill. You know her as Dana Tan in this wonderful show. Lauren Tom! Okay, that I'm gonna, I want to ask in private, so you guys don't listen. Um, and I, I hate to do this in front of Lauren, because Dana and Terry were so close, but did Terry and Ten actually spend the night together? Sure, Alan says, sure. Sure? Okay, sure. I was curious. They, they definitely set it up that something happened, but I didn't know if they were cartoon intimate, as it were. You know, it's amazing we got to 52 episodes with this show. There's so many adult things that go I know James is, is literally not answering. Well, um, I assume they were bonking everyone. Uh, I mean... <laughs> We never made these shows for kids. I mean, yeah, kids were watching, but, you know, the discussions we had amongst ourselves were, were decidedly not kid-friendly, so... <laughs> okay, cool, I just wanted to... You can start the again, I what just did, wanted to know. What did, what did Lauren think? Um, I, I don't know, I'm glad, uh... That's a long time ago, water under the bridge. Nice. <laughs> you, you got married to him, so... Exactly. Yeah. Come on!
Man, you're something. I've never seen anyone. 